Hello everyone, and welcome again. In this video, I explain to you how to create a GPO and apply it to domain users, to prevent them from creating a new folder, or from changing the name of any folder on a specific drive, such as Drive D. This policy may sometimes be needed to prevent domain users from changing the name of any folder on Drive D. And let's start quickly. The first thing you have to do is open the Server Manager dashboard. Then click on the Tools menu at the top of the page. And from there select Group Policy Management. And after opening the Group Policy Management window, click to expand the forest on the left side, and select the domain you will work on, if you have more than one domain. And I will apply policy to the test container. Right click on it, and from the menu select Create a GPO in this domain and link it here. And in the new GPO window, enter an appropriate name for this policy. And click the OK button. After that, right click on the GPO that was just created, and then click on Edit. This will open the Group Policy Management Editor window. After that, expand from the left until you open the path that appears in front of you on the screen, and I will leave the path for you in the description of the video. Then move to the other side, and right click on any empty space and from the menu, select Add File. Here I will specify Drive D, to prevent the domain user from creating any folder, or changing its name on this drive. If you want another drive, select it. It will open database security for Drive D, so you can specify the permissions you want. At the bottom, click on the Advanced button. Now click on Add button, and then click on Select a principle, to specify the user or group to which you want to apply policy, and prevent them from changing folder name or creating a folder. Then enter the name of the user you want to block, and you can add more than one user or add an entire group. After that click on the OK button. Then click on Show Advanced Permissions to view all permissions available to this user. At bottom, click on the Clear All button, and thus all permissions for this user on Drive D have been revoked. Select Only Read Attributes, so that it can open folders on the drive, then click on the OK button, then the Apply button and OK. In the Database Security window for Drive D, you will find that User Test 1 has been added, but without any normal permissions. Click on the OK button, and you can now close Group Policy Management Editor window. You can now open the client computers, and log in with the user test 1, and you will find that this user has already been prevented from creating, or changing the name of any folder on Drive D. I hope that the video is useful to you. And I thank you for watching. And I also hope that you subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.